This year I lost 80 tomato plants to leaf curl. How do I get rid of leaf curl and protect my tomato plants? And this is Arthur. So Booker, we'll start with you. So how do you think you get rid of leaf curl? Probably the same thing, heat yeah. stress on there, could be heat on there. And I would check the underside of the leaf for maybe a little mice or something in there. That could be some of the things that's going on with leaf curl uh, on there. Anything you want to add to that, Elena? And, and the leaf curl is, is a symptom of stress. Right. Mm -hmm. They're showing right. they're stressed. Right. Mm -hmm. um, I think when, when my plants leaf curl, then I feel sorry for them. <laughs> I think, but my first thought is they're diseased. They've got okay. something. Right. So again, your fungicides, when you're worrying about them, you can spray your fungicides. Okay. And, but those are preventative. Right. If they right. are actually leaf curling because they've got a disease at that point, it may be too late. But right. as a course, you're, it's a good time too to spray your fungicides because as they're being stressed, maybe from the heat, right. that's when you have to worry about them catching something. Okay. So use your fungicides and alternate what you use. All right, those are two good points. Uh, one I would like to mention, there is a physiological uh, leaf cur curl, which is actually due to environmental stresses, mm -hmm. which is heat, you know, for us. Of course, you know, do look for mites, mites you know, insect yeah. pests, which could be, you know, sucking uh, on those uh, leaves themselves. And something else I know that causes leaf curl, herbicide drift. Mm -hmm. Right. So that's something else you have to look out for it too as yeah. well. It could be, you know, somebody may be spraying mm -hmm. a herbicide nearby, mm -hmm. uh, which affects the younger tissue. Uh, so this is a couple of things to consider, but for the most part, we're probably thinking it's environmental stress. Yeah. And, and, uh, which sometimes you can't do anything about right. what may be a neighbor spraying. Right. But you can watch your own drift mm -hmm. and right. also your water runoff. Right. You right. might be watering the lawn and it's drifting, it's migrating over to the plants. Good point. So. That is a good point. And, and a lot of time when I'm like tomato plant, I like to try to rotate those in the garden if I can okay. to another location because it could be something in the soil that causes that. Mm -hmm. and, and a lot of times the disease don't like certain disease on certain plants. So okay. maybe try to rotate your tomato to another location in the garden if you get a chance. Okay. So crop rotation is important. Mm -hmm. Resistant varieties mm -hmm. would be something else that's important as well, well. And a lot of times your drift too, though, on your herbicides, they'll start to alter how they grow as well. That's mm -hmm. right. So exactly. I would look for that so you know in the future what you know, if that was the cause of it. Thanks for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed. To subscribe, click below.